Hey folks, Machine Repeat here. Hope you're surviving this week of record heat all over the country. Looks like we've had heat index up over 100 uh, throughout all the Midwest and looks like most of the country. Uh, but you know what? I think Thursday uh, might be the perfect day to attend a multi-million dollar farm equipment auction. Now the benefit of this sale is it's an online auction at purplewave.com. So you can sit in your air-conditioned office or on your sofa, pour yourself a tall, cool glass of lemonade and bid on some uh, just incredibly low-houred, late-model uh, equipment. Now you might have seen the, the column I wrote a week ago, my weekly column for agriculture.com. Uh, I was talking about this auction and it caught my eye for a couple reasons. Uh, first of all, it's... Uh, a large caterpillar dealer, um, a group uh, Dean Ag Services out of western Missouri and eastern Kansas. Now they have seven stores total, five ag based, um, and what caught my eye was the, the number of tractors and combines on this auction. We're talking 25 mostly late model combines and just about that many later model tractors on this sale. And again this late model inventory um, always catches my eye but uh, especially Caterpillar uh, you know very interesting to see how the equipment sells now last week I actually talked to JD Manning the general manager of Dean Ag Services down in Missouri and a lot of times on these big dealer auctions you know people ask me you know hey Pete what's the scoop behind this sale why are they having this sale is this really absolute um, you know kind of natural questions like that and it was interesting talking to JD. Um, they have a very strong ongoing commitment to egg equipment there with Dean Egg Services. But JD was very upfront. He just said actually uh, this excess inventory was related to their uh, egg rental business. Um, and they're just basically trying to clean up some of the used inventory that built up. Um, now, all these combines, uh, most of all of them were local rental deals. Um, so locally owned and operated uh, rentals and again a lot of them are very low hour um, and if we go to purplewave.com website again it's just uh, purplewave.com we can take a look at this sale bill now I know the folks at Purple Wave um, if you're not familiar with this online auction site very good folks they were uh, they started their business back in 2002 I believe and just have grown throughout the years um, they're located in Manhattan Kansas um, I think started fairly local Kansas uh, Nebraska Colorado area but have been expanding I know last year 2010 I believe they had 130 internet auctions so you're talking over 10 a month and I think total asset values they sold over 50 million dollars worth of equipment um, and they do sell a lot of ag equipment. Now here's the sale bill. July 21st for Dean Ag Services rental fleet. And we'll just click on it here. And here you can click on the sale bill. You've maybe seen this ad in your uh, regional papers. I know it's been widely advertised, but again, it's an online auction. The bidding closes Thursday, July 1st, 10 a.m. Central Time. Um, you can see some pictures of nice looking equipment there but uh, let's look at some of the, the equipment lineup here if we look specifically you click on har the harvesting link you can see they have 58 pieces of equipment listed um, so let's just walk through quickly some of the combines um, quite a few gleaners we got an R52 um, you can see the online bidding has already started there's 19 bids on this 95 model R52 just over 3,000 engine hours. Uh, another R52, R62. You can see all the details right here. Uh, but I want to go down here and look at some of these lower houred uh, Lexion machines. Because it, it's difficult to find these out at auction. So this is a pretty unusual opportunity to buy some of these later model low houred. Um, you know, Lexion combines. Uh, so here's one that's interesting. It's a 2003 460R four-wheel drive. 
Look at the hours though, only 786 engine hours, 493 separator. And if you click on the picture to the left here, Purple Wave does a really good job. Uh, you can see the beautiful picture there. But look at all these pictures they provide. So basically every angle, anything you'd want to look at in advance, um, you know, if you're sitting in Illinois or Ohio or Montana, and it's you know, tough to drive to Missouri to look at this stuff, uh, really good job with pictures and they also have a lot of video on a lot of these items you'll see a little uh, video camera link you can click on but you can see the bidding they already have 16 bids here up to 32,000 for that 03 460R but if we uh, keep scooting through the list here you'll see one two three four five seventy R's all with low hours. Here's one with 318 separator hours, bidding already up to 51,021 bids. So again, you know, a real opportunity here um, to to get into some pretty late model low hour Lexion combines. Uh, and here's the video link. You could actually watch video of this 570R. And I believe they have a an even lower hour one here coming up. There's some. 585 hours, very nice combines. Um, yeah, here we go. We're into the 670s now. And let's see where this one is. Here it is 2009 Challenger 670B rear wheel assist, 50 engine hours, 23 separator. And this combine is located in St. Joseph, Missouri. Um, so an 09 model with 50 engine hours on it. So pretty interesting. Now, of course, you can bet I'll be interested to see how all this equipment sells. And the other interesting part about the sale is with PurpleWave.com, they're very upfront about the fact that, I mean, this is an absolute sale. They don't really put up with any monkey business from buyer or seller. Um, I mean, they put equipment on this sale and it sells. And I've always liked that about Purple Wave. Uh, like I say, I know the folks there. Uh, we're actually, we'll see a little uh, video interview here with Jared Westfall, the CEO of Purple Wave here shortly. And Jared will explain uh, a little bit about Purple Wave, more about this auction. But again, they're good folks. They're expanding quickly. I know they just hired a new rep up here in Minnesota. So I think Purple Wave, you're going to start to see more of their name, um, you know, all over the country uh, here. So again, this sale is uh, Thursday, July 21st at purplewave.com. Bidding is open right now. Thursday, July 21st. Um, so yeah, now let's go to Jared Westfall, CEO of Purple Wave, and learn a little bit more about this sale and listen to the end of this video interview what Jared has to say about Purple Wave and absolute auctions. Hey Pete, it's Jared at Purple Wave Auction. I'm here to tell you a little bit about the Dean Ag Services auction we've got coming up July 21st at purplewave.com. Bidding's open now and uh, we've already got a lot of bids coming in from all over the country for these high quality late model pieces of ag equipment. There's over 150 units selling in this particular auction. Dean Ag Services carries Agco and Lexion lines of ag equipment. They also carry Great Plains uh, planters and seeders, and uh, they're really uh, putting a big package of equipment up in our no reserve auction. Open now for bidding, closing on the 21st. Uh, Dean Ag Services is one of the premier uh, ag equipment dealerships uh, in Missouri and eastern Kansas, and uh, this is a great opportunity now that the, uh, the crops that were planted earlier this year have popped out of the ground in a lot of places. Everybody has a pretty good read on whether the crop's going to be made and the commodity prices sure support uh, the opportunity for bringing in a valuable crop this fall. Uh, this auction is really highlighted with 26 combines. Those combines range from 585R Alexions uh, with the tracks up front uh, to uh, some uh, R72, 62, 75 gleaners. There are an awful lot of Challenger combines in this auction as well. And a nice lineup of uh, some 570R Lexion combines that uh, are fairly low houred. And uh, anybody who runs Lexion machines in the past can attest to 
the quality of those uh, those machines to get in some of those uh, some of those big high yielding fall crops. Uh, there are a few green combines on this auction as well, and even uh, a case uh, 2388 combine. So I encourage folks who are looking for whether it's a combine or heads to go with them. Uh, encourage people to dig into this auction because these assets all sell to the highest bidder regardless of price. Included in this auction are also uh, some high horsepower tractors, including uh, three track tractors. Uh, excuse me, four track tractors. Two of them are yellow, two of them are green. Uh, 9300T, 9400T John Deere. We've got an MT855 uh, with less than 5,000 hours. Uh, nice Challenger tractor. And then we've got a, a CH60 and then a couple of older uh, yellow Challenger track tractors as well. And then for guys who, uh, who are looking for a nice uh, 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 row crop uh, utility size tractor, we've got uh, several 500 series MT Challenger front wheel assist tractors, some with loaders, several of them with <clears throat> relatively uh, zero, close to zero hours, less than, than 100 hours on several of those units. So I encourage uh, folks who are uh, looking for good late model used equipment of all types to really check out this auction. All the photos, uh, seller contact information, videos of a lot of the, the power units are all on our website, purplewave.com. The good folks at uh, Dean Ag Services would be happy to take a call with questions about the history on these machines. A lot of them have been used in the rental fleet that uh, Dean has, has built up over the past few years and have been rented out to uh, local farming operations in the Missouri and eastern Kansas area. Dean is uh, trying to reduce that rental fleet back down and get focused uh, a little bit more heavily on making retail sales of ag equipment and this is uh, their uh, opportunity to take advantage of, of what uh, should be some strong interest in good equipment uh, with the crops uh, looking like they'll be productive again in most parts of the country. So I want to encourage everyone uh, to take a close look. If you don't know someone uh, who's, uh, if, if you don't personally have any interest in uh, what you see, be sure to let your neighbors know because this is a real buying opportunity. We've got some Great Plains uh, twin line uh, uh, air seeders as well with central uh, uh, cart systems on them. Several of those actually uh, in this auction. We've got uh, corn heads, uh, flex platforms, rigid platforms of all different shapes and sizes in this sale. Uh, we even got some uh, application equipment with some uh, Ag Chem uh, three and four wheelers. We've got a Patriot sprayer in this auction as well. Great lineup, over 150 pieces of equipment. Bidding is easy. Everything happens on our website, purplewave.com. Uh, registration is free. Uh, it's a lifetime registration. You register once for Purple Waves auctions. You can uh, bid in any of our auctions uh, forever and uh, we'd be happy to help somebody get registered here uh, at the home office of Purple Wave. All the contact information is on the website, purplewave.com. No uh, registration required to get on the site and look at the assets, understand uh, where they're located, understand how to contact uh, the Dean Ag Services representative to learn more about those assets. The videos and pictures are all free as well. No need to register to, video to, uh, to see those. So. Lots of uh, reasons why uh, this is a great opportunity. We encourage everybody to pay close attention to it. Uh, we get asked fairly regularly from people who've never done business with Purple Wave, what do we mean by no reserve auction at Purple Wave? Because in some parts of the country, uh, the definition of no reserve uh, may be different. But in our, in our part of the world and how we run auctions, that means that every asset sells to the highest bidder regardless of price. Neither Dean Ag Services, nor Purple Wave, nor anyone acting on, on our behalf or on Dean's behalf will be bidding on these assets. It will not happen. That means that only legitimate arm's length bidders will be uh, determining the price on these assets. So uh, come one, come all. Uh, take a look at these 26-plus uh, uh, combines selling in this auction at the 30-plus tractors and uh, at all the application equipment and other harvest tools that are available. A lot of hay tools in this auction as well. Again, it's at purplewave.com. Bidding is open now. There is no penalty to bid early. There's no reason to wait. I encourage everyone to engage, and uh, good luck in your bidding. This has been Jared from Purple Wave Auction, and we look forward to seeing you on our website. <clears throat>
Well, thanks, Jared. That's good information about purplewave.com. And again, this auction is Thursday, July 21st, purplewave.com. Now, I think I'm going to do something kind of fun that I've started to do a few times here um, on our Machinery Pete Facebook page, which if you just come to our website, machinerypete.com, over on the right here, you can click on the uh, link, and that takes you to our Facebook page. And what I've started to do on a few auctions while they're taking place is I, I do some live running commentary. And it's uh, it's really fun. I, I try to provide some context. So when a tractor, combine, or planter is, uh, is in the process of selling, I like to chime in and say, well, here's a similar one that sold uh, last month in Michigan or Texas. Um, give you average prices, things like that. Uh, kind of like you're staying there at the auction and you're watching these items sell and everyone talks well that's sold high, that's sold low. Um, that's what I like to do, just try and chip in with commentary. Um, and I actually did that last week um, with a sale here. It was in Starbuck, Minnesota, West Central Minnesota. Real nice farm auction by Zilsdorf Real Estate and Auction. My friend Bob's a very good auctioneer. Um, you can see here left, I left a little comment trail uh, following the sale live. Um, yeah, and it's just fun. Feel free to chime in with comments or questions on our Facebook page. Uh, but I hope this can be kind of informational. Um, so again, the sale on purplewave.com Thursday the 21st, the items start to, the auction, online auction begins to end at 10 a.m. Central. So I'll kind of be online on our Facebook page, um, you know, probably 9.30 or so, um, leading up, maybe 9 a.m., and doing some commentary. And then the, the auction, as bids come in, there's a little extended time that kicks in. So, uh, yeah, I'll just be having fun doing some commentary. But, uh, again, uh, very interesting auction coming up Thursday. We'll see how all this late model equipment sells. I'm Machinery Pete. See you at the sales.